All right, there's no business like show business, but in our small business spotlight, there is a new company you need to pay attention to because it's changing the game on how you can bring people together to watch a movie or a documentary. Let's bring into the stream uh, Christy Marche uh, Marchese. She is the CEO of Kinema. And tell us more about what it is you do, because I know you just added 60 new titles to your documentaries, but how does this all work? Sure, uh, th thanks so much for having me. Uh, at Kinema, we help people launch their own movie house so they can support the filmmaking they wanna see. So we do this uh, in two ways. We've built an operating system for filmmakers to manage their own non-theatrical exhibition, which means screening tours or booking your film and kind of mixed use spaces, um, as well as online. And so that library that we're building up, uh, we're doing partnerships with distributors, we're working with independent filmmakers to essentially list these films as available for bookings in places that are not traditional movie theaters. So we say it's not a movie theater, it's not your home, but it's everywhere in between. Anything that has sight, sound, and seating uh, to show a movie in person. And we found that um, individuals and people who work at these, at these establishments actually curate essentially mini film festivals. They curate the films that work for their neighborhood, for their audience, for their constituency. And then of course, during the pandemic, we built a virtual version of it. What are some of those establishments? I mean, give us some examples just in terms of where people are going to view these movies or documentaries. I think the top places are, are still libraries and churches and community centers. Um, so, so we have a, a couple pastors who are amazing, uh, essentially movie house runners. They, they're curating films, mostly documentaries uh, for their communities. We're also uh, in schools. We're working on campuses. We work with different student clubs uh, to bring films on the campuses. We do partnerships with libraries. I'd say for the last year, though, it's really mostly been online. We actually set to launch initially about a year ago, right when the pandemic started. Not the best time to be launching a company in the, in the movie business in March of 2020. So we uh, focused on the virtual product. So our hosts then are connected to churches, libraries, schools, um, communities online, influencing, um, and they posted virtual cinemas, which have the ability for the audience to chat with each other. The director can pop in and do a director's cue introduction or a post-screening Q&A, or we have a couple special events coming up where we actually have directors doing a behind the scenes or talk over as the film is actually going. Uh, we should point out, you were named a Fast Company's Most Creative People of 2021, uh, but I imagine a lot of the people who look at this and some of the VC that might invest in this want to know what the total market is. Have you identified how big a market there could be for what you're offering? I mean, yes, we were looking at the theatrical industry. So what we're doing is a form of independent exhibition. You hear about independent movie houses, it's independent exhibitions. So our exhibitors and our screening hosts are individual proprietors, again, of all these different establishments that I mentioned. So we look at the theatrical business, you're looking at $11 billion like annual, industry, annual blah, market industry. Forgive me, I'm like, let, so what is it, seven hours ahead? And so I'm a little brain wiped. Um, <laughs> and then a total um, international market of $40 billion. So we're, we're comparing to that. And we look at how many movie theaters there are in the U.S. Um, there's about, I can't remember now, 40, 4,500. I can't remember. Uh, and we're looking at about, we have about 20,000 spaces already in our network. So, um, yep, so that's what we're looking at. All right. Listen, we wish you all the best. We totally understand. We, I'm going to little a little secret out. You've been partying at a wedding. Go have more fun. You're allowed <laughs> to be a little bit off, but you did great. The business is exciting. Give us an update pretty soon. All the best to you. Um, Christy Marchese, so CEO much. of Kinema.